Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy Alex right here. I'm going to take a drive out, see if I could capture some footage for you guys today. Not sure where I'm going to reach, but what I'm going to do, I'll see you there. Okay, this is the bad boy right here. Yeah, man. So I'm gonna see what I could catch for you guys today. Hope I got something nice today so I can give you guys a catch and cook today. a big one but it's my first fish for the day I'm not gonna keep this one it's too small If you guys ever go out on the pier on the docks, wherever you fish, then just if you cannot work, you can go get yourself some squid or some sprat or some balahoo and try that. So I'm gonna get this guy back in the drink. So let me get him off the hook. guys it's a boy right here boy Alex right here yeah I've been casting from morning don't catch anything as yet as I said before every day is a fishing day but not every day is a catching day recording mate okay guys this is first catch for the night as I told you guys before I wasn't going until I get something for you guys to cook tonight this is a mountain snapper this is this one is about 15 yeah, also, I don't, have a, I don't have anything to measure today, so you guys can see. 
It's a beautiful fish. <laughs> Look. Look at the fish, Ozzy. Yeah. This is a mountain snapper, guys. I promise you guys that I was gonna catch something for you and see I got something. So I'll see you in the kitchen. <laughs> this one, okay? Look at this beauty, guys. I couldn't help but showing you this guy, this fish again, guys. Wonderful fish, beautiful. Okay, guys, I have to do a voiceover for this one. So you can see I have a beautiful mountain snapper right there for you guys, as I told you guys before, that I was gonna go catch and cook for you. So, bear with me for this voiceover. So as you can see, we have some nice seasoning and sauces here. Over there we have some hunter's hickory sauce and some soya sauce. We also have some barbecue sauce in that dish right there. And that's the pan right there. Well, um, spray with um, oil spray. We have some hot pepper. We have some Maggi season over there. We have some gar onion powder, some garlic powder, some um, white onion, green onion, and we have some blend up that I made a couple of years ago. Still good, nice. Yeah, man. I don't know soya sauce and all them sauce. Really hard man thing, you know? Yeah man. So guys as was uh, as I was saying, that's a hickory sauce right there, the hunter's hickory sauce and some sauce. Okay guys, as you can see I was slicing up this baby right here. I didn't cut it right through. I just cut it halfway down and let it stay together. I made four cuts in this fish. So Yep, that's it. I have a powerful knife to you guys and I turn over the other side, make some core just to get the seasoning into it. Nice and easy. Yeah man. I um trim off some of the peg fins and dorsal fins. Yeah man. So as you guys can see I was just rubbing in my seasoning. Make sure I get everything in nice and decent amount of seasoning all over I flip it on the next side same thing over and over yeah man I like to use a lot of seasoning on my fish because I don't I don't season my fish and marinate it I season and cook at the same time it was a mountain snapper it weighed at least about three to four pounds yeah man very nice fish guys very nice So we have some garlic and ginger here mix. So I'm gonna spread it all over. As you guys can see, I like to use plenty garlic, plenty ginger. Yeah man, really hard man thing, you know? And don't forget the scotch bonnet pepper. And now I'm gonna put my blend up season equally along the line here sorry about that guys line some green onion and some white onion just to give it a little flavor yeah man and add some more Put that maggi seasoning and then we we'll finish lining it off with our blend up season and i have some rosemary here i like to put the rosemary on my fish when i'm baking it to give it that wonderful baked flavor that aroma yes beautiful guys i already oil my pan some spray oil, some pan spray oil, 
so it won't stick inside this pan so now I'm gonna add a little lime and, lime and pepper to my fish to give it that lemon flavor not too much guys because I don't want it to get bitter or sour yeah just that will do now I have some barbecue sauce here I'm gonna add some more to it yeah and some soy sauce sorry guys my hand touch your camera not too much I don't want it to get dark and now I'm gonna mix this together and I'm gonna paste it on my fish Beautiful. Beautiful guys. If you guys haven't subscribed as yet, please go ahead, hit the subscribe button. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the notification bell for more videos to come. You know, it's the boy Chef Alex. Yeah man, yard man too. Yeah. Nice. So I'm gonna stick this in the oven now. Look at that guys. I'm gonna stick this in the oven now and give it at least 20 minutes. Yeah man. And also I have some potato. I'm gonna bake some potato for my side. As you guys can see it's almost ready. It's almost ready guys. I've turned the oven down a little. fish sit in there for another three or four minutes just to get some of the juice out so okay guys this is the finished product we have some red potatoes here and that's the barbecue fish one of a kind barbecue fish so I'm gonna dish this baby out now I'm all by myself so I have a nine to five job so I'll bring some for my lunch tomorrow to work. Yep. And this is how it goes. So I can't eat this all by myself. So tonight so I'm going to take a little piece. I'm going to have a little piece now. I'm going to have this section. As you can see it's a very big fish. I'm gonna have the tail section. I like to keep my fish whole, guys. I know some of you guys like to fillet your fish and whatever. But I like to keep my fish whole. Look at that, guys. Isn't this beautiful? Look at that. Some of the sauce in it. Beautiful. I said before this is my salad that I prepare I decorate this myself if you guys like it give me a thumbs up I don't know the boy chef Alex now I'm playing so I'm gonna ruin this beautiful dish right now I'm gonna add it to my dinner I like vegetables guys so I'm gonna take a lot of that. Yep. 
see you guys on the table. We're gonna let you guys know exactly how this tastes in just a few. You now we're back on the table, guys. Is this beautiful? Look at this beautiful dish right here. As I said before, if you guys want to know the recipe, as I show you all, I can be all in the I can give you all the recipe in the description box. If you want to get straight to me, just leave a comment. This one is one of a kind guys as you all know Chef Alex and did that Yeah man with the barbecue fish So I don't have a camera man So I have to do my video on myself Got that nice beautiful white meat there guys with That beautiful barbecue sauce Here you go guys beautiful white meat This is a mountain snapper that I promised you guys I was gonna make a video for here we go we're gonna taste it now delicious someday I have some audience so you guys can know that I'm not faking this Everybody who knows me out there know once I put my mind to whatever I'm doing it's gonna be the best of whatever I do. So you guys stay tuned. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, share and watch and watch and watch and hit the notification bell. It's your boy Alex, Chef Alex right here. I'm out.